Tonight, we spoke with researchers who said the study showed so much progress in helping people who suffer from anorexia that it could be looked at as a breakthrough. Can magic mushrooms help a person overcome an eating disorder? That's what UC San Diego researchers wanted to find out. But there's no FDA-approved medication for anorexia, and this tends to be kind of a chronic and, for some people, a deadly disorder. Walter Kay founded the UCSD Eating Disorder Clinic. Their research team was hopeful psilocybin, the active ingredient in magic mushrooms, might have the power to change the perception of a person with anorexia and open a door to recovery. The whole purpose is to really kind of be with all of those experiences to kind of figure out if they can find new information or have some transformative experience that might kind of break through. Ten people participated in the pilot trial. They were given a high dose of magic mushrooms in a synthesized pill form. They went through therapy before, during, and after their experience. Stephanie Natspeck described how one participant who suffered from anorexia for nearly two decades responded. During the experience, she talked about having her eating disorder, a vision of her eating disorder coming out of her as a skeleton and dying in front of her. And in the very next day, she reported to me that she felt like she no longer identified with the idea of having an eating disorder. These results have researchers wanting to learn more about psychedelics and anorexia. They're now recruiting for a larger phase two trial to compare placebo to an active dose. I've been in this field a long time and I've seen, we've had very little that really kind of changed the perceptions of people with anorexia. So I think this is, this is very promising. Right now, organizers in California are gathering signatures for a ballot initiative that would decriminalize certain psychedelic substances, including psilocybin mushrooms. It would allow doctors to prescribe the mushroom and allow people to grow it and use it for recreational purposes. Jasmine Ramirez, CBS 8.